All right, let's do it. <laughs> Oh, you go, go, go. So, <laughs> the flea market was closed. We drove all the way there and it was closed. And then we stumbled upon a town wide garage sale. Yeah, so stick around, see what we found. Good morning. Good morning. Little babies. <laughs> yeah. Little babies. <laughs> Size nines. Yeah. Too big for me. If you want a bag, I'll give you a bag. You want to put a bag full of it? $2. I think you can fix those, you know? These are kind of cool. You like that? Those are kind of cool. Like a pencil sharpener. The sun is too shiny. You want to turn around? Can you say please? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll bring you around. Here you go. Is that better? Can you stay there? Don't move. Thank you. What's this? The Pingo Gobbles. Oh. Yeah. I think Miles plays with those at school, right? Or daycare? Uh, I think he does. Yeah. All the, all of the art that comes home is just like that. Yeah. Thank you. Fill it up, you know? If you like anything, babe. Here. Yeah. This one's kind of cool. Oh, yeah, that one's nice. Yeah. $2 a bag, so fill it up. $2 a bag. Hello. Thank you, guys. Say hello. Do they like cookies? I give each a cookie. Oh, do you want a cookie, Tommy? Yeah, I'll give each one. A little one. Yeah. Not really a sweatshirt weather, but. I know, right? I like this one too, Montauk. Okay. He's filming all of my rolls. It's good to be thickums. <laughs> Keeps us warm in the winter. It's the summer. Huh? Is she cool? Everything free in here? Yeah, little oh, I think I got two dollars for you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> here you go. Right, Thank you. you. Got them in the shade. I got them in the shade because it's too sun. Oh, cool. Cool. Yeah. Except we don't have Hercules, Lady in the Tram. Small soldiers, we don't have a thing. We sports. And it comes with it's got that and then two more huts. Yeah, it's got two more huts. DHS, $2 each. What does it say on the games? You should buy the sticky buddy and make a video and make a fun of it. Ooh, those are cool. <laughs> crossfire! Five bucks. Is this the original Crossfire from, or is this a newer one? I don't think it's one? ever been opened. Oh, is it like the original one though from I, like I the 90s? Don't know. I don't know. I remember the commercial. Oh, oh no, it's 2016. <laughs> I remember this when I was a kid. Nice day, right? Oh, yeah. 
You got two dollars, and then what do you have on the games? That was hers, so that has Kelly. Thank you for wrapping. You're welcome. Thank you so much. Two dollars on the VHS, right? Yep. And then what do you have on this? I take that. For two dollars? Yeah. Okay. No, <laughs> now I'm gonna take a look in a second. You see the cats? I did. I want them. Which ones do you want? <laughs> no, all the. Oh, there's yeah, there's a box. Oh, no. It's three for a dollar. Oh, no. I think we have to buy all of them. <laughs> these are cool. Hey, look, to see which ones I you want. These. Remember our original cat, Mewtwo? Oh, they broke them. The cats broke them. Our cats broke What do you have on? A dollar each for that one. A dollar? A dollar. A dollar, two dollars. Two dollars? We have an eagle? Yeah, how much is that? The eagle is two dollars, and that's carrying my daughter. So two dollars for the eagle. Alright, that's for the eagle. <laughs> and then... A dollar for the cats. A dollar for the cats, and then two for the Pokemon. Two for the Pokemon. And then one dollar for the album. Look at that! Alright. <laughs> no? Nah, I don't think so. Like the logs everywhere. So I did step on them <laughs> everywhere. Yeah. No, they're not as bad as Legos. They are not as bad as Legos. <laughs> they don't have Legos. They kind of, they kind of roll a little. Yeah, they're too little for Legos. I don't want them to choke on them. Yeah, no, we don't have Legos. The mega block, the oh, mega the blocks. Bad, or, bad. Yeah. All right. I think we're good. Hmm? I think we're good. Here we go. Anything over here is 25 cents. 25 cents? Okay, cool. A cool one. Uh, I think I'm ready. This okay. is just a little guy too. Alright, so a dollar even. Okay. Do you need a bag? No, nah, no, nah, I'm okay. Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. So we have that Almond Brothers shirt? Yeah. You see we have the poster up there? No, nah, I didn't see. Oh yeah, right there, right? Yeah. Well, we used to have a. a I'm gonna see these. Oh, okay. In Sarasota. So we got the had them. And we knew the uh, musician here from Sarasota. Yeah. You got any T-shirts like any more T-shirts like this or anything or no? No. Okay. Yeah, yeah, if anything. I like the older t-shirts. This is cool. No, that's okay. Thanks for asking. That's a dollar. 
a dollar. And then what do you got on the, the poster? He was asking three on that. Three? Because the frame itself was a lot more than that. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. But you know what? You can have it for two. So three bucks for both? Yeah, three bucks for both. Okay, I'll do it. And then if you want these posters, you can have them. Yeah, I'll take them. Why not? He had them on the wall. So that yeah, that's fine. Three dollars. Thank you. Hello, how are you? Good. It has a lot of stuff inside of it. Like yeah. Dolls and you can open it. The 60s, right? Yeah. <laughs> well, that's cool. Okay. Stuff in that bin too. These are um, my little ponies. <laughs> see, see uh, that's kind of cool. Mm -hmm. It's the 60s. Mm -hmm. Three dollars? Yeah, we need this. I'll get it. Would you do? You have three on this. Would you do 25 for that and the Barbie set? Just 25 and three, just throw that in for the... Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, this is cool. Ready? How's it going? Good, how you doing? Good. Anything in particular? Nah, just driving around today, looking around, okay. trying to kill some time. What do you got on the records? Little wheel and deal. I got three of them. One Elvis, two Johnny Cash. How about a buck a piece? Sounds good with me. See, he's a seasoned veteran. <laughs> Thank you I'm, I'm just going to keep looking real fast, see if I see anything else. Play golf? There's plenty of 
Nah. Does she push you for when you're watching uh, a concert? You don't got any old like t-shirts, like racing t-shirts or anything? No. Uh, All right, let's do it. <laughs> and there aren't a whole bunch of peeps on the back. On, uh, on the back side, too? Okay. Yep. Why not? Thank you. Thank you. I See, I knew music people would recognize that right away. Yeah. <laughs> say, oh, I know what that is. Thanks, guys. All right, thank you. Have a good weekend. Okay guys, we're back home now. We had a pretty good day garage sound with the family. We're just gonna do a little recap. Let's get into it. First yard sale, I think we paid $2 for everything. It was like fill a bag. We could have probably filled some more stuff, but there wasn't really that much stuff there. You have this vintage uh, Nautica, I don't know, Trump Plaza or something. It is on the Fruit of the Loom tag, double XL. Made in USA. Next, we have a vintage Montauk sweatshirt. It's really not sweatshirt weather, but basically paid a dollar each for those. And then in the free pile, they had this cool little cat thing, cat cards. I don't know. I figured I'd just pick it up. Can't really remember the order of uh, what we found stuff, so I've just got everything lined up. We'll just go through it. It's not going to be in order, but uh, it is what it is. Next garage sale, we did find a couple things. My wife got a couple cat pieces. We pulled... What is it? I think it was this one. This Elvis vinyl for a dollar. Uh, we did get the Pokemon VHS and the Wii Sports. This is only two bucks for the, the combo. Obviously, Wii Sports is always like worth like 20, 25 bucks. So definitely a pickup. The Elvis vinyl, I don't know. I paid a dollar for it. Uh, it's probably worth a couple bucks. Reason why I picked these up is there's a vinyl shop like a town over from me. It's always like a buy sell trade kind of thing. So if I can get them cheap, I usually just buy them and then try to flip them to him. We did find some more hats. I should not be buying hats. I have a million hats. <laughs> these are only a quarter a piece. You have a Harley Davidson, a little worn, 25 cents. The cat, 25 cents. And this pretty cool Honda one, 25 cents. After I picked up those hats, she was saying that she had like an Almond's Brother uh, poster. It's this Sarasota Blues Festival 1998. She was asking $3 for this. She dropped it to two. I don't know why. Uh, she's a nice lady. Threw in all these posters with it. So it's like 98, like 2000, early 2000s. This one's 2003. This one's listed on eBay, I think for 20 or 25 bucks. And then we did pick up the Marilyn Monroe poster. Hopefully my yeah my ring light's gonna put a glare. But for a dollar, I'm definitely picking this up. We did scoop the 1964 Barbie case full of Barbies and all the accessories. I don't know too much about this, but I felt like $25 is a pretty good deal. I feel like all the money's in the accessories. I don't know, if it's probably gonna fall out, but, but yeah, there's there's three dollars in here and there's so much clothes. Everything is basically packed, shoes and stuff. It's pretty cool. I think I get my $25 back. I think the case alone is worth 20 bucks. So definitely not bad. And then coming down to the last yard sale, we did pick up this whole cassette, little case full of cassettes. Picked up three vinyls actually. I'll throw a clip in here before. Uh, I had the two Johnny Cash ones and this one. I brought this, obviously the, the vinyls and the cassettes to the record store to try to sell them like the same day to flip them really fast. Okay guys, I actually filmed a little video of this, but it didn't work. It's just like showing a still image. So we did get some good stuff. We had BC Boys, Run DMC, the cars. Just a decent amount of good stuff in here for five bucks. I just wanted to show you before I end up selling some of the stuff. Yeah guys, I just basically blind like bought this. I didn't know what was in it. He said five dollars for everything. I showed that little clip just now because... Like I said, I just picked up like one or two of the cassettes and he's like $5 for the whole case. And I was like, yeah, I'm gonna buy it. And then I put that clip in here because we were going out later that day and we were passing a shop that sells vinyls, cassettes, like VHS. So I was like, he's probably gonna want some of this stuff. I'll probably be able to at least double my money on this $5 investment. So I brought the vinyls that I did pick up and then the cassettes and he offered, I think like $15. He took the two Johnny Cash vinyls. 
and he bought like a handful of the cassettes. It was like the Cars, Run DMC, uh, BC Boys. Some of those cassettes are like worth like five to fifteen dollars, but I don't want to actually like deal with selling that stuff. I don't sell on eBay, so I basically just did the quick flip. Fifteen dollars. This thing is still full, so probably gonna sell this locally. So you still have some good titles, ZZ Top, uh, Robert Plant, The Who, Eagles, uh, Eric Clapton. And then I still have some on the bottom side too. So not too bad. Yeah guys, let me know if I missed anything. I did flip through a lot of the vinyls. I, I'm not a vinyl guy, I don't really collect or do those. I basically just pick them up to flip them really fast at that shop. The Barbies I'm probably gonna try to flip locally or maybe I'll throw them on eBay for like a uh, auction, like started at like 99 cents plus shipping and then see where they go. I feel like all the all the profit should be in the accessories I think I can get my 25 bucks back. Like I said the case is definitely worth 20 alone Yeah, guys, so that's gonna be it for this video. Don't forget to like comment subscribe. We'll see you in the next one